I'm gonna give you guys a quick look at my workout, how I train. And I'm not saying you should do the same workout, but maybe you can incorporate some of the ideas that I use in my workout. So I start with a warm up, and typically I warm up only the things that I'm gonna be using in the workout. So today, I'm starting with some handstands for my skill work. So I'm mostly gonna warm up my shoulders and my wrists. to my skill block. So how I train this is I set aside an amount of time and I spend that time just trying to make the movement better. I don't worry about how many sets, um, how many reps I do. It's really just about improving that movement. Um, during my rest periods I'm going to work on some flexibility work which today, lucky for me, is some middle splits work. is not quite there today and so rather than just getting frustrated and doing hundreds and hundreds of reps um, and falling over I am focusing a little more on a skill component where balance is not quite as important because I'm going to keep one of my hands on the floor so I'm working on trying to lower down really building that strength in that shoulder During this skill block, I'll typically be kind of going back and forward with my camera, watching watching reps, sometimes while I'm sitting in a, in a split, so that I can see what I need to do better um, to kind of get the skill closer to where I want it to be. Today my skill work was about 20 minutes, so now I'm moving on to my conditioning work. And these kind of little circuits that I do are a combination of the strength work that I need and uh, the prehab, rehab flexibility, uh, active flexibility work that I need. So take a look and uh, see if you can incorporate some of these ideas into your training. So that was four rounds of that circuit, and I'm going to do four rounds of another circuit, which is really a combination of some compression exercises that I'm working on, some front levers, really just to maintain, it's not one of my main skills right now, um, along with some work for my shoulder stability. So I did four rounds of that circuit, it took uh, 15 minutes and now I'm just going to do my finisher which is um, everyone's favourite handstand endurance. So I'm going to kick up, I'm going to hold for as long as I can and then when I come down I'll rest for the same amount of time I was up. Trying to accumulate five minutes total time upside down. Um, and at the end of this my shoulders, forearms, wrists, core are going to be a little bit tired. That was my workout, uh, about five, six minute warm up, 20 minutes of skill work, 10 minutes on my first circuit, 15 minutes on my second circuit, and then about eight, actually more like 10 minutes of um, handstand endurance. Um, so squeeze a lot into around an hour. <laughs> 